Seattle's Tom Douglas has helped define the culinary style of the Northwest at his five restaurants. And he's one of the featured chefs at this week's annual Bon Appetit Supper Club, an eagerly awaited event here in Manhattan. You were cooking last night. I was cooking last night for a big old crowd of fancy New York chefs and yeah. stuff. And Bon Appetit magazine had me out. And I'm so thrilled. It's, right. it's really fun. So what fun. happens today? Today I'm going to do a demo around 12 o'clock, 1230. And then all these dishes you see in front are going right. to be featured all week long at the Bon Appetit magazine cafe. Wait. Way cool, way cool. So, yeah, We're making so. some salmon this morning. Not just any salmon, but <laughs> Tom's really cool, better salmon. Rub would love salmon. Rub okay, so Harry, if you want to just grab some of this rub, mm -hmm. that's a nice mixture of a little bit of brown sugar with mm -hmm. smoked paprika and thyme and things like that. Brown sugar is smart. And we're going right. to put a, kind of a golden crust right on that fish, okay? Yeah, all right. So just pop it right in here when you're ready I to go. To, I need to, I need Rub it till it hurts. Rub it till it hurts. <laughs> okay. Wow, you <laughs> are a messy rubber. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> all right, here we go. All right, there we go. Now, you hear that little sizzle, we're gonna put a little crust on here. Now, one of the things I wanted to tell people about today is, you know, so many people are scared to cook fish at home. Mm -hmm. uh, that's a good place to start, a little, a little bleach. A little rub, yeah. A little bleach wipe. Oh, okay, But yeah. um, we're gonna put the crust on, and when we flip this, yeah. we're gonna let this fish just kind of, we're gonna turn the heat off and let the residual heat oh. warm the fish through. Right. People are scared to cook fish because they overcook it all the time. Yeah. Oh, it makes my house stink. That's because you're overcooking the fish. Okay. So use fabulous fish and then cook it right. Crisp now, it up first. Turn it over, turn off the heat. Turn off the heat, let the residual. I like it. And so uh, the other thing is if you have a meat thermometer, you mm -hmm. just want to stick that in the center, 120 degrees. That's pretty simple, right? That'll do it. Gives you that little translucent center. Right. Okay. Perfect. All, All right. right. Very cool. So then we, we take this. We have some very good stuff working here, right? That's right, exactly. So here's it. So this is the finished product. That's, right here. that's what it looks like finished. That's We're going to move that a bit. Yeah. And now I've made a little fennel mayonnaise. Yeah. So just mayonnaise with a ground fennel seed, a little mustard. Unbelievable. Delicious. Look at that. All right. So you just want to slather that on a bit. See, so good. That doesn't feel like funky, nasty. Oh, we're having salmon tonight. I know. Ugh. And right? people, well, people just think that you can only have salmon one way. Well, it's right. not true. You can make all sorts of cool things out of it. It's a great football snack, right? right. Healthy. Look at that. Little salmon right Ooh. on there. And then I like uh, just little baby arugula. Just kind of give it a nice green freshness. Yeah, yeah. I like it a lot. Well, now, why is the cheese out there? The cheese is out there. That's for our next dish oh, here. Oh, okay. But I'm going to make this and get, get you a bite of that. All right, Dave, come and eat this. Thank Look you. at that all sucker right, right there. Now, that. see that? Look at that color. That's that perfect. is perfectly cooked fish right Look at there. That. Okay? There you go. Eat hey, that. Russ, try this. All right. There you go, Russ. So then. <laughs> Thank you. Hi, Russ. Hey, you? nice to see Tell you again. Good to see you, too. Yeah. All right. All right, so what's our next one here? What is so this soup? we've got a little, let's let's flip this guy right here. Oh, my gosh. Oh. All right, there we go. Do it. I do can't. it. No, I can't. I, I, no. There'd what? be fish everywhere. Let's just turn we that turn heat it off. off there. So this was on there maybe three yeah, but minutes. It's, you know, it's that thin, right? Yeah. So, and that warmth is just going to give you that luscious scent. Do you oh. like salmon? Did you? I love. This is insane. It's, it's very insane. Good. Insane. Yes. We like insane. All right. Yes. So good. So we good. are insane. All right. Another so what kind of soup here. This is a little uh, tomato soup from the Dahlia Bakery, my little bakery in downtown Seattle. Right. And my trick here is, I take a, a grilled cheese sandwich, right? Uh, a little pesto, a little cheese. Can you see that? Oh, look at that. And then we just take this, yeah. and we make croutons out of it. Oh, oh. <laughs> right? So boom, boom, oh boom. There better be a spoon around here. Now my mom, I don't know about you, but yeah. my, I grew up with tomato soup and crouton, and brown right. butter croutons. Yeah. So. Oh Eric. my gosh. So oh then we go like that. Dude. And you can see the green. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh. Just kind of, you have your soup and sandwich together. All right. What are the other dishes here? So we have our soup and sandwich deal here. There's right. our very cool sandwich down there. That's the salmon sandwich. Then we have a crab louis with bacon and kind of a, uh, my own little Thousand Island style dressing. Right. So it's going to be on the menu at the Bon Appetit Magazine Cafe all week long. Way mm. cool. And all you need then to accompany this is a great like a Pinot Gris like from... Pinot Gris like, or you know I come from Washington the second largest wine producer state in our country. Oh. So we have Washington Chardonnay. Oh, oh Chardonnay. Right. Mm. Right. <laughs> all right Tom. Thanks so much Paul. All right. So my great. Pleasure. For these recipes all you have to do is go to our website. That's, that's earlyshow.cb mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, news.com.